set theory, the operation of T and I, or transposition of the inversion, involves two steps. First, inversion around the pitch class 0, or pitch class 6, both of which produce the same result. For example, pitch class 2 inverted over pitch class 0 results in pitch class 10, as it is now equal distance from pitch class 0, but on the opposite side. Inverting over pitch class 6 produces pitch class 10 as well, as it is equal distance from pitch class 6 on the other side. Noting that the inversion properties are the same for both pitch classes 0 and 6, an inversional axis may be drawn in to visually show a line over which pitch classes are inverted, traversing to their inversional counterpart on the opposite side of the axis line, much like a mirror. It should be noted that this vertical inversional axis, which inverts pitch classes over 0 and 6, is the default inversion when a transposition is not applied. Or to put it another way, the transposition is 0, as indicated by the number 0 in place of the variable n in T in I. After the first step of inverting the pitch class or pitch class set, the transposition portion of the T in I function is applied, which is the second step. Let's briefly review transposition before combining it with inversion in the T and I function. Transposition is simply moving a pitch class or pitch class set up in pitch class space by the number of semitones indicated by the transposition number. For example, to apply transposition 8 to pitch classes 5, 8, and 9, just add 8 semitones to each pitch class Apply mod 12 adjustments to numbers greater than 11. Or rotate the whole set 8 notches around the clock face to the right. Now to show you a method to combine these two functions of inversion then transposition into one operation. Remember that the TNI operation starts with inversion over a vertical axis of symmetry the default position when no transposition is applied. Now, to add the operation of transposition, simply rotate the axis of inversion clockwise half the amount of the transposition to be applied. For example, to transpose the inversion by eight semitones, rotate the axis to half that value, four. To transpose by seven semitones, rotate the axis to between three and four half the value of 7. The reason that the axis is only rotated half the value of the transposition is that the inverted note travels twice the distance of the axis placement. Notice how pitch class 0, which would remain on 0 for the non-transposing vertical axis, maps onto pitch class 7 when the axis rests between pitch classes 3 and 4. Now, to apply this clock face operation, to a trichord set. Let's take pitch classes 0, 2, and 5 and apply T9I to them. You may pause the video now if you would like to try the operation on your own first before seeing it demonstrated.